Hey friends, Shane Parent here with the Remax River City's Platinum Team, and I am joined with Allison and Chris, who are rock stars, and uh, today we're just going to give you a quick update on what the heck happened in April. And so uh, what we've really been seeing is a bit of a slowdown, which is kind of neat to see. <laughs> a lot less multiple offers. Uh, there's been some recent interest rate increases, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. but although the perception is that it's a big deal, it's pretty minor, right? But people are feeling that, and that as such, kind of activity has slowed a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it's a bit of the calm before the storm, to be honest with you, and I know that Edmonton is still among the top five cities for value in the right. world. And so because we're here, it's hard to, what's that, you don't see the forest among the trees or yeah. something like that. And so there's huge opportunity here in Edmonton mm -hmm. for investment, for people to, uh, to settle down and, uh, and put their money into Edmonton. So uh, with that being said, let's get a quick update on what's going on in the condo market and what's going on with the single family market. Who wants to start? I'm gonna go. Single family, let's do it. So single family, uh, it's not quite as chaotic as we were seeing um, in March. Um, depending on areas of the city though, the south, I'm generalizing here, is still quite robust. Um, you know, things are turning and burning quite quickly and there's still lots of multiple offers, but whereas we were seeing say 20 or 15 offers, we might be getting half of that. Um, you know, negotiated a deal the other day and it was under this price. Now that would probably be the exception rather than the rule, um, but it was still multiples and it was still accepted under list. Right. So mm -hmm. it's not all of them going above, um, but yeah, overall it is settling down a bit. So that's probably a combination of there is more inventory, um, you know, the interest rate stuff's having a piece of it. So uh, overall days on market, it's around 23. Um, that's still much lower than it was last year. Um, year over year, single family homes are about, um, they're up about 10 to 11%, um, and still month over month, they've increased around 2%. So we're still seeing increases, um, just not as drastically as we were at the beginning of the year. Great, yeah, mm -hmm. healthy, I think. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Mm -hmm. uh, and then uh, condo market, what's happening? Well, we saw a little bit of a yay last month. Mm -hmm. This month, they've calmed down. <laughs> <laughs> apartment style condos, I should say. Row housing, a different category, but uh, apartment style condos have gone down a tad from last month. Mm -hmm. um, about 3.7% from last month. So Bad for sale price. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, for yeah. the price, sorry. That's um, okay. Yeah, and so, I mean, they're still moving. Um, and we're not seeing as many multiples on them, but they are still moving a little bit of a lull again, back to kind of where we started, but they're moving. Yeah. <laughs> cool. The, uh, so we'll do a quick uh, report this time. Let's do high low for the, for the month of May. There was uh, some movement. We always like to celebrate <laughs> what's been going on, give you some perspective, right? So mm -hmm. yeah, uh, I'm going to do uh, sure. single family. So oh, right. okay. on the low end, uh, single family, more so a development lot in Parkdale, and it sold for 145. Went multiple, so it went over asking. Um, and that was a Remax on both ends. Nice. On the high end, um, <laughs> Big Mama Jamma in uh, Windsor Park, and it sold for 5.15. That's huge. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Wow. Great. Yeah. Oh, and again, awesome. over ask. Nice. How big was that house? 6,200 square feet. Wow. Two story. That is a house. That's almost as big as our office. Yeah. <laughs> I think I was going to say it's more than a house. <laughs> hey, let's talk high low condo. So, on the low end of condos, one was sold in Beacon Heights. It was 573 square feet, and that sold for 40000 40000 Nice. Condo cool. fees, pretty average on that for what we're seeing in apartment style condos, only $400. $40,000 condo with yeah. $400 condo fees. Yeah, it gets you started and, uh, or as an investment. Uh, yeah. Nice little easy thing. Yeah. yeah, cool. On yeah. the high end? On the high end, we're going into the Southwest Windermere area. Uh, this condo was over 2,000 square feet, oh. just about. And this was at the Signature in Ambleside. And this sold for $650,000. 650, 650. Love it. Yeah. Well, and 
I made a note that, uh, you know, although in Edmonton, almost 40% of all deals has a Remax agent mm -hmm. on one side or the other. Mm -hmm. It was cool to see on the high lows for this month all that Remax. they were all Remax oh on all sides. So the, yeah. yay, Remax. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and so uh, just in closing, is there anything that you guys are looking for for buyers that you're not seeing out there that we could use some help on? Yeah, inventory. <laughs> <laughs> bungalow, beautiful bungalow in the south in a great area. 1,300 plus square feet. Um, that would be good for a family of four. Really looking for something like that. Um, condos, I guess, you know, two bedroom, two bathroom, decent condo fees. Basically downtown condos are great, but also in the newer divisions as well. Right, so if you or anyone you know mm -hmm. has something like that that they're looking to sell, reach out to us direct. Please. Maybe we get an off-market deal, no yeah. showings, any of that stuff. Uh, also, as we always say, real estate is neighborhood specific. So if you do want a little bit of an insight of uh, what's going on in your neighborhood mm -hmm. or what, uh, how this economy has affected your home's value, we're always happy to have a chat and be a resource for you. So reach out Absolutely. to uh, ten of us. Have a great day. you making all the way to the end of this video uh, we hope you found some value here we very much appreciate it if you would like and subscribe and hit the notification bell scotch 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 I like scotch